CBR California bearing ratio by dynamic compaction method. Concept and significant California bearing ratio CBR test was developed by the California Division of Highway as a method of classifying and evaluating subgrade soil and base course material for flexible pavements. CBR is defined as a force per unit area required to penetrate a soil with standard circular piston at the rate of 1.25 mm per minute to that required for the corresponding penetration of a standard material. CBR value is expressed as a percentage of the actual load causing the penetration of 2.5 mm or 5 mm to the standard loads. Therefore, CBR is equals to load carried by specimen for 2.5 or 5 mm penetration divided by load carried by standard specimen for 2.5 or 5 mm penetration into 100. The following table gives the standard loads adopted for different penetration for standard material. Normal CBR of soft grade is taken at 2.5 mm penetration or 5 mm penetration. Then the standard load for 2.5 mm penetration is taken as 1370 kg and the standard load for 5 mm penetration is taken as 2055 kg. Apparatus. This is the metal rammer, weight of 2.6 kg with a drop of 210 mm for a light compaction and weight 4.89 kg or drop of 450 mm for the heavy compaction. This is the cylindrical mold of inside diameter 150 mm and height 175 mm and a base of 10 mm thickness. And this is a detachable extension collar. And there is a special disc of 400, uh, 148 mm in diameter and 47.7 mm in height. And this is the figure showing the different, much different equipment or apparatus used for the CBR in lab. And take about 4.5 to 5 kg of soil, soft grid soil, soft base that is 20, 20 mm down and written on 4 mm and mix with OMC thoroughly. And in this case, we use the heavy compaction and uh, the given soil sample is compacted in 5 layer and each layer is blown with 4.89 kg through a height of 450 mm and each, blow, each layer is blown with 56 mm number then after compaction remove the collar and trim off the soil excess soil by a straight edge then wet the mold with compacted soil and determine the bulk density and dry density The specimen in the mold is subjected to 4 days soaking and swelling and water absorption value are noted. And this is the following uh, figure showing the typical testing machine for the CBR in lab and the soaking sample. And testing the specimen. After the 4 days soak, the soak specimen is allowed to drain off water in vertical position for 15 minutes. The sample is weighed again to calculate the percentage of water absorbed. Then place the mold assemble with the surcharge weight on the penetration test machine. Set the stress strain dial goes to read zero. Apply the load to the plunger so that the penetration rate is 1.25 mm per minute. Then record the load reading at penetration of 0 0.5, 1, 1.5, 2, 2.5, 3, 4, 5, 7.5, 10, 12.5 mm.
after the load measurement for the respective deflection detach the mold from loading equipment take about 20 to 50 gram of soil from top 3 cm layer and determine the moisture content and this is the figure showing the collecting sample of soft bed soft bed soil that is passing to 20 mm passing and written on 4 mm and this is the figure showing the mixing of optimum moisture content in that sample and total mixing and we use the heavy compaction in heavy compaction the soil sample is compacted in mold in 5 layer and each layer is rammed with a rammer of 4.8 kg and each layer is rammed with a blow of 56 time this is the assemble for the seabed test and this is a typical testing machine for the CBR in lab and this is the penetration dial gauge this is the plunger this is the probing ring dial gauge observation and recording that this value is the load penet load recorded from the machine for a respective penetration for sample 1 and sample 2 then the value is plotted on graph in x-axis penetration process y-axis load and this is the graph showing for the sample 1 and this is uh, this is the ideal nature of severe curve since the initial curve is convex upward there is no need of correction that's why we take the uh, load for 2.5 mm penetration and 5 mm penetration and for 2.5 mm penetration the load is taken lo load is determined as 34 kg and similarly for 5 mm penetration the load is taken as 48 kg therefore CVR at 2.5 is allocated as 2.48 percentage then CVR at 5 mm is taken as 2.34 percentage and this is the graph showing the sample 2 and in this case the initial curve is convex downward that's why we need certain correction in that curve the correction is applied by drawing a tangent to the curve at a point of greatest slope greatest slope and the tangent in intersect the x-axis at a point of 1.7 in this case then the initial original origin 0 is shifted to 1.7 and for 1.7 we take the 2.5 mm penetration that is 4.2 mm penetration that is 2.5 mm penetration for the corrected graph then the respective load is taken as 33.9 kg and for the 5 mm penetration the 5 is shifted to 6.7 mm and the respective load is determined from the graph as 46 kg therefore the CVR for the corrected graph is calculated as CVR at 2.5 is calculated as 2.47 then CVR at 5 is calculated as 2.24 result and conclusion the CVR values are usually calculated for penetration of 2.5 mm and 5 mm Generally, the CBR value at 2.5 mm will be greater than at 5 mm, and in such a case, the former value shall be taken as the CBR for the design purpose. If CBR for 5 mm exceeds that for 2.5 mm, the test should be repeated. If identical result follow, the CBR corresponding corresponding to 5 mm penetration should be taken for the design this is the table showing the design soft grade severe percentile for a various design traffic load determination of design severe 
the result of soft grade soil in severe at several location obtained in certain stretch of road are given below determine the 87.5 percentile design design soft grade severe first we arrange the severe values in decreasing under that is 11 to 4 then in second column number equal or greater than 11 is taken as 1 similarly number equal or greater than 4 is taken as 7 that is the cumulative after then percentage equals to or greater than 11 is 14.29 and similarly percentage equal or greater than 4 is taken as 100 percentage then the value CVR versus percentile is plotted on a graph and in x axis CVR is plotted and y axis is plotted as design percentile then we have to take we have to take 87.5 percentile as a design percentile so CVR therefore 87.5 percentile the vertical line is drawn and the intersect at a graph then drop down the line to the x-axis that is severe then a design severe is taken as 87.5 percentile is calculated from the gra graph as 5 percentage in this way we can calculate the severe of any traffic design traffic category Please like, share and subscribe my channel for more videos, lecture and tutorial. Thank you.